Hello, awesome morticians, and welcome back to the series of videos on the new Mortic Community Portal. In this video, I'm going to explain a bit more about the membership list and how that works, how you can claim your membership if you are already a member. So the first thing to say is this will appear automatically once you accept the terms and conditions. The first thing you will see is the memberships tab, which I'm showing you here. So when you log in to your account, if you don't have this, so for example, you became a member after you started using the community portal, you can access this again by going to the drop down here and my account, and then it will be under memberships here. So you can see here that this is unlocked. So I haven't actually claimed and it's saying, are you a Mortic member? Get verified against the membership list. And there may be a delay. So at the moment, this is a manual process. So when you actually become a member on Open Collective, we're manually synchronizing this list once a week. And once you have become a member, all you need to do is to click on this button here and it will check to see if your email address matches the email address of a uh, contact in our membership list. Now, if you have any problems with this, it might be that the email address you used on Open Collective doesn't actually match the email address that you're using here. So this email address might be different. If that is the case, it's not a problem. All you need to do is drop us a message in the community channel on Slack, and we will be able to update the email address in our membership list to match the email address that you use on the community portal. So now that this is actually registered, it means that I have access to some things that other people don't have access to. So when I go to assemblies and I go to general assembly, it means that if there's a meeting or if there's proposals, I can actually create proposals, but also I can engage on them. I can attend meetings so I can join the meeting because I am actually registered as a member of Mortic. Whereas people who are not a member are not actually able to attend meetings and they're not able to vote and they're not able to raise proposals. So yeah, that's how you actually go about claiming your membership. And if you ever have any problems, go back to this section, the membership section. And if you've become invalidated for some reason, maybe your membership lapsed and then you've rejoined, do the same process again. So it will be unlocked. You click on the button here and then you'll be able to be uh, associated. Like I said, if there's any problems at all, just drop us a message in the community channel on Slack. We'll have a look and see what we can do for you. That's all for now. Thank you for being a member and we'll catch up with you soon.